Hey guys, it's Lunar Gem. Today I will be reviewing Funko Pop Fluttershy. So, she, I can tell right now she looks awesome from in the package. So, her number is two. You can see it on the side, too. <laughs> two, two. There again. And here's all the ponies you could get. Derpy. Of course, Fluttershy. Pinkie Pie. Rainbow Dash. DJ Pump 3. Twilight Sparkle. And Dr. Hooves. So... There's also another, sorry guys, I was reading that. It just says that you could collect the entire line. But they also have like more, like four more with Discord, Trixie, Princess Lusty, and Spitfire. These look awesome. So let's get her out of the box. Whoa. I love how easy these are to take out. So you don't have to ruin the box to try to get them out. You could put them back in the box if you want. Whoa. She's awesome, and she's a little bit more heavier than Rainbow Dash. You can turn their heads. Oh, and there's their little wings. Oh, cutie mark. Little butterfly. She's really cute. So you could have her sitting like this. Sitting like that. Or straight. Unless you wanted her backwards. I just have mine sitting straight when they're on display. So. I really love. They did an awesome job on the hair. And it's hard to see on camera, but like it doesn't look very good right around this area. I don't know what happened to the plastic. And of course you guys could probably see that on camera. I don't know what that is. And then the little bit of dark pink spots. They do pretty good, but sometimes the pink jobs aren't a hundred percent perfect. So yeah, there's Funko Pop Fluttershy. I think she's gonna go awesome with my collection. So let's move on to the next part of this video. So we all know it's Blind Bag Friday. But, tomorrow starts October 1st, and it's time to open one of these up. I don't know what one to open, so I'm just going to pick one. I'm so excited. I hope I don't get one that I already have. I kind of want to open the big one, but kind of the little one. Because I'm afraid the big one's going to be shining armor again. Mmm. Mmm. I'll be right back once I pick them. So I decided to go with the bigger one. Since I got Apple Bloom last time, which is a smaller one. And so these are the Milo Pony Funko Mystery Minis. 
You can find them at Hot Topic, Toys R Us, Walmart. And I've been getting these at Walmart because they're cheaper at Walmart. They're only like $6 at Walmart. And they're almost 9 or $10 everywhere else. So, I know I go over this every time, but just reminding you guys what ones I want the most. I don't have the regular Princess Lustia yet. I don't... I have the Glow in the Dark Lustia, though. I don't have Luna yet. I don't have the Black Princess Cadence or the regular Princess Cadence yet. I have both Shining Armors. The white and the black one. Don't have Scootaloo. Don't have Nightmare Moon or Chrysalis, which I want super bad. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Don't have Sweetie Belle, or Ma, Pie, or Spike. This is the Cunemere Crusader I got last time. And she's awesome. And then there's Cheese, of course. Cheese sandwich. He's on the side of the box. So, let's get this open. So, why I picked a big one? Like, Nightmare Moon and Queen Crystal seem like they're, like, Halloween-ish. This is October. Oh, I'm scared it's going to be Shining Armor again. That would be funny if I they accidentally put two in one of these. This feels like... It doesn't feel like Shining Armor. It's an alicorn. It's an alicorn. It's an alicorn! <laughs> Princess Luna? Everyone gets excited over her. She's my favorite princess. Well, I like all the princesses, but I really like Princess Luna. Awesome. Because, like, I'm having trouble finding a couple of the ponies. You know the ponies that go with the castles? That have, like, the brushable hair? I don't have Princess Luna yet. I don't have Princess Celestia yet. Or Nightmare Moon. Or Queen Chrysalis. Or Shining Armor. I might be getting the big Canterlot Castle. And the castle with Baby Flurry Heart. So I will be getting Princess Lustia with the big castle if I get that. But what I'm saying is maybe I could use these for the castles instead. And I love Princess Luna. I still don't have the regular Funko vinyls of them yet. Of Princess Lassie and Luna yet. Because they're like almost $200. Between $100 and $200. And that's pretty expensive. But I do know they're awesome and very popular. So that's probably why they're so expensive. So real quick... I had to check and see how long I've been recording. I'll just review her real quick. So, like, her hair's along her, like, face, but you can still see her other eye in between that. They did an awesome job on her necklace. She has a little scratch there, but I shake them around in the box to try to feel if it's big or heavy or something but she's awesome so there's her nice blue eye with her eyeshadow love it like how it looks in the show sometimes when the hair is blocking the face here's her crown I can never remember if she has a little white moon on her crown too So, 
Yeah, that's about all there is to review on her. But wait, we forgot about the most important thing. I love how they had the sparkle see-through on the outside of her main and tail. So, next, let's get to the line bag Friday. And Princess Luna loves to pick the blind bags. I want one of these two. So I'm just picking that one. See how easy that was? A lot quicker than last couple times. So... The cards right here, I usually like to cut along this crease. And it is... And sometimes... It's, oh, never mind. Oh, awesome! Percy Pink. I just got her in the brushable version the other day. Or last weekend. Whenever it was. She has a closet full of pocket books. Pocket book. Seems like she's more into fashion by her name. In cutie mark. But. It says she has a closet full of pocket books. So here she is. In the same model as Pinkie Pie. She looks awesome. There's her small little pink eyes. Her eyes are so small. Awesome. So I'll be right back after I clean up and set everything out to end the video. So there's what I got today, guys. Hope you enjoyed. So, Fluttershy is really nice. Percy Pink's really nice. But I think I'm going to go with my favorite today being Princess Luna. Because I've been, she's one of the ones I've been waiting to get for a long time. So, there's my ponies. And tomorrow, I might get... The Canterlot Castle, that's the big one that's like $79. But, luckily, I had a garage sale just recently. And I sold my American Girl and got $125 out of her. So I could be using that money. And if I get the castle tomorrow, I'm going to tell you right now. I don't know how long it's going to take me to get that thing put together. So I might not be able to record the whole time I'm putting it together or else the video will take forever. So there's what's probably going to be going on this weekend. Just letting you know. Giving you a heads up that I might be making another video tomorrow. If I do get the castle tomorrow. Bye guys. Hope you.